Good morning. Today we'll be inviting you to visualize yourself as a section of river. Maybe a picture of the riverbed and the river bank or the, and the flow. And this <coughs> visualization of the river is a metaphor for the self. Upstream, there is water. Downstream, there is water. Here in the middle, there is you. Perhaps the river here is deep or swift. Perhaps it's shallow, perhaps it's quiet. Perhaps it's producing bubbles. And it flows in one direction from the past to the future. From what was to what will be. From your childhood to your geriatric years. Perhaps it's partly frozen. Perhaps it's warm or glacial cold. And as we consider ourselves in this present moment, in this present body, in this present place, we recognize that we are inextricably linked to what came before to what came before and what comes after and I invite you to muse in a meditative manner on what are your sources what feeds this river that is you? What tributaries come together to create you or support you or reveal you, nourish you? What source contributes to you? Perhaps your ancestors, perhaps stories. What might be the psychological source of this you that is this section of river? What contributes to you? What's a tributary to you? Is it food that you eat? Is it beliefs that you hold? <sighs> Remember, we're just musing here. We're not seeking some final answer 
or perfect description or meditatively musing. Is the breath you take a source? Is some drive acting as a source for you? What comes together to be you in this section of river in this moment? tributaries to make this river. It's continuing to breathe gently, quietly, deeply. meditatively musing. Does the river hold the memory of the headwaters? Does the river have an inkling of the delta? Next, I'd invite you to meditatively muse on what is downstream of you, the river, you, this section of river. Marsh, lands, oxbows, floodplains, River divisions or confluences. Turns and bends, rapids, waterfalls. All the many, all the myriad expressions of the river downstream from you. Are you not their source? Are you not their source? Is there some responsibility felt? If it occurs to you that they relate to you as source, might that change how you are here as this section of river now? If they see you as source, might that change how you see what you see as your source? There 
river breathes. We breathe. We are connected to source. And something downstream from us is connected to us. And we are its source. Thank you for joining in and tipping with stars and sharing and commenting. This is my effort to offer something from the hospital of value. Love.